All right. Good morning, Carmenita Cougars. This is Mr. Castillo, and today is Thursday, February 8th. And I guess that many of you are expecting that we're going to go ahead and get started with our flex sign-up process. However, we're going to switch things around a little bit. I think it's more appropriate to provide you with a quick tutorial on the new sign-up process, because as you can see, this is a new setup and a new design that you'll be using from here on out. So students, please follow along. I'm going to walk you through this process. I'm going to point out a few things here. You're going to be getting a link tomorrow morning, Friday, in your homerooms, and you'll have an opportunity to sign up. Now, of course, you won't need an entire homeroom period. It's going to go by very quickly, students. However, I want you to notice a few things because I'm sure I'm going to find that a few students are going to say, well, I was confused or I wasn't sure what to do, Mr. Castillo. I could only find one page. There was only three classes there. So the link you're going to get is going to bring you to this page here. And on this page, you're going to have access to a link with the uh, – Flex menu that you can peruse is, is the electronic menu. You won't be getting a hard copy anymore. And students, I want you to look through it because it will be updated with some new classes. I know some of you miss this Shark Tank class and some other updates that were on here. So please make sure you're paying attention. I recently sent out a survey and I had a lot of students respond that they wanted to start their own Flex class. And I think this is great. I want to encourage our students to be creative and be a part of this process. And if you are interested in uh, having your own class, there's a way that you can actually get started during this next Flex session and design your Flex class. But once again, students, uh, that's the link that's gonna take you to the Carmenita Flex menu. And here are the classes on the first page. And you heard me correctly, this is only the first page or the first tab. And on this first page or first tab, you have access to three classes. And this is how it works. It'll give you the title of the class, the teacher name and the classroom and the number of seats that are available and a tab where you can sign up. And I'm going to walk you through the sign up process. But before I do that, I want to show you how you can access the other classes that are available. So what we've done is we've categorized the different classes into these tabs that are available for each of you up here. You can start with movies and films. And these uh, classes here are related to movies or films that you'll be watching inside the classroom. Uh, again, looking at the first class, uh, The Hobbit with Mr. Harris, Anime Films of Hayao Miyazaki with Mr. Chadbourne, and 201's Magical Flex Theater with Miss Towning in room 905. And students, once again, if you click the link on the menu, you'll be able to see that that class uh, provides you with an opportunity to see the story of the students from McFarland as you'll be watching McFarland USA. Uh, so we don't have the description on the tabs, but you do have the title of the classes. Let's say, however, you are into sports and you don't necessarily want to sign up for a movie and you can click on the tabs that are up here. As you can see, I'm going with the cursor. I'm going to click on sports and it's going to take me to my three classes that have sports um, related themes. First one being Ultimate Frisbee with Mr. Nyquist, Flag Football with Mr. Woodbury. And for those of you who want to once again go into those elementary days, you have Kickball with Mr. Kellerman. And we have 40 seats available or 40 slots available for students to fill up. So uh, you, what you're going to do, students, is you're going to click on the one that interests you. And I'm going to show you some more tabs before I do that. We also have some craft classes, Tea Under the Sea with Miss Stanton and Kabuki Paper Mache with Miss Kim. We have our study halls, which have become very popular for students. One thing I do want you to pay attention to is the short uh, comments that are left on each one of these. It'll indicate whether the class is for seventh graders only, eighth graders only, or seventh and eighth graders. So please make sure you're paying attention to that, students. If you are a seventh or eighth grader, please sign up accordingly. Now, we do have a music and rhythm and beats class. Now, there is one class in there that's pencil tamping with Mr. Watts. And then for our other category, we do have our other classes listed here. We have Chinese Yo-Yo, uh, Diablos with Mr. Lobo and Watson Hall, uh, Flag Team with Miss King, Family Party Games with Mr. DeGucci, Game Day with Mr. Hines, Going Beyond TED Talks with Mr. Hua, Mom's Cooking, and once again, the Shark Tank class that I mentioned. And this may be updated by the time you sign up tomorrow, students, so please make sure you're clicking on the menu and going through this. So just a quick rundown, once again, make sure you're scrolling through the tabs and finding the class that you'd like to sign up for. Uh, if the link that you're gonna receive tomorrow will only bring you to this first page. And I just wanna make sure that I avoid any confusion with students saying, well, these are the only three classes I could choose from. So please students follow along. 
You're going to click on a tab. I'm going to select the class now and I'm going to show you the steps that you need to take to ensure that you can sign up. Once you get to this page, you're going to go ahead and click on the sign up button. You're not done yet. There's a few steps in the process that you have to complete. There's a yellow tab down here. Make sure you click on submit and sign up. That'll take you to the next page that will begin to register you for the class. So you're not done yet. You must fill in this field with your name, first and last name, so that we can register you for the class. Enter your email. This is very important because you're not only going to register for the class by completing your email, but you're going to get an automated email. It's going to go to you and give you the information on the class that you're signed up for. All students must use their abcusd.org account. Once again, students, you must use your Google account that's been issued to you by the school in order for you to register. There are some fields up here that you can ignore. Please do not put anything in the comment or quantity section. You're going to leave that space alone. And then, just like our older form, you're going to go ahead and indicate your homeroom teacher. So you make sure you find your homeroom teacher, you click on that, and then you must click on this sign up now. This will complete the registration for you and it'll bring you to this page. It'll tell you that you've been registered for the class and now you've completed the registration process. If you get a message that the class is full, you'll have an opportunity to go back, find another tab, and then register for another class students. So just like our other forum, there's gonna be some students that may not get to their first choice. I wanna recommend that our students have second and third choices in mind as you begin this process. And just to caution all of our students, please don't click on the back to sign up process. At this point, uh, this is an option for students who say perhaps, well, you don't wanna go back and change it. However, the link will be closed uh, after a few minutes. And I wanna caution students that if you go back and try to register for another class, the other class may not be available anymore. And by the time you come back to your first choice, you might find that the seats have filled up as well. So I want to encourage all of our students to make their first selection, go through the process. If you get to this page, then you're all set. Go ahead and uh, close up the Chromebooks or give them back to your teacher, sign out, but avoid going back and forth and trying to find other tabs. Once you've gone to this page, you're all set to go. And then beginning Tuesday, when we come back from our three-day holiday, uh, we'll be on a flex schedule and you will know your assigned flex class today. This video will be available on the Google Classroom today after 1.20. So students, you'll have an access to the video. If you have any questions, you can come back and look at it. Uh, but that's pretty much about it. I hope you guys enjoy this new process. It's a new look, new design, and new process. Please students, make sure that you are completing the registration process as instructed, putting in your first name, last name, homeroom, and your email. If you've missed out on any one of those, it will take you to an error page. It'll get, have you go back and fill in that information. And again, time is of the essence, so you must make sure that you're following the instructions. If you have any questions, students, please make sure to come out and find um, Mrs. Williams today. She'll be able to assist, or perhaps even one of our teachers who may be able to help you with any of the questions you have. Or you can email me. Uh, you students have my email available. It's robert.castillo at abcusd. Dot us and I'll make sure to try to get back to each and every one of you. Thank you, and I hope you all have a wonderful Thursday. We hope to see you back later tonight for our open house students. Thank you, and have a great day.